Hey guys, Tao here. We're back and we're going to play some more Don't Starve. And this time we're in chapter 3 for the adventure mode of Wilbur. Eventually we're going to get through the whole cast, but we're starting off with Wilbur from Shipwrecked for some reason. <laughs> now, the main reason is because he's very mobile, he moves very fast. That's why I did it. Also, it'd be interesting to see him at the end. I don't want to go into more details than that because not everyone knows what that it means, but it's interesting, to say the least. <laughs> Sadly, he has no commentary, so he won't get everything. But anyway, this is two worlds in Chapter 3. You start off with everything on this side of the world. It's pretty nice. You can have almost anything that you want here, so you can just set up and start making anything you need. And this is usually where I take my time and just get a bunch of supplies, a bunch of pre-done pre -done, uh, building stuff, just so I can bring it on to the future chapters. Because it starts off easy, but the other side of the world is where it gets tough. Like, what have I pre-made? I have a crock pot and ice box. That's pretty good. I'll get over here. There we go. Yeah, I could probably just pick the carrots too, but I don't really need to right now. I'll pick them when I need them. Getting grass and twigs is always the first thing you want to do. Hey, no life queen. Actually, it's not shipwrecked. This is, uh... This one is uh, adventure mode. With Wilbur. I'd make a... I'd make a... I think it was it Charlotte's Web joke or something? Was it Wilbur the pig? I think it was. But, uh... I actually can't remember much about Charlotte's Web other than... Oh, spider saved the pig's life at the end. <laughs> Well, there's more to it than that, and I know, but I can't remember all the quotes. I just remember when I was younger, people would go, Wilbur! And <laughs> some, for some reason that was funny, and I can't remember the reference. Either way, we're in Chapter 3 so far. we got two more to go, the last one being the hardest. I don't know what's after this, I forget. I think it's, oh, Spring and Winter version or something. My bad. Also, Wilbur the pig. It was Wilbur the pig. Okay. That's what it... I thought it was, but I couldn't be sure. Hmm. You know, after I get a couple silk, maybe I can go ahead and uh, make a couple... make some uh, bee boxes, and I'll bring that to the future chapters. Not that it, they're very useful or anything in the future chapters, but they exist, and who knows. It's a way to summon bees to kill them for honey and bee stingers or something, I guess. Anyway, I know this is, this is the most exciting part of the game, where I gather up materials, you know? <laughs> Mostly I just wanted to do this for getting myself prepared. Swigs and grass, the staple of all your all your stuff in Don't Starve. Alright, we got plenty of grass now. Doing okay. Alright. We also are gonna have plenty of pigs. Actually, I hope one of the pigs' names are, are Wilbur. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. I mean, usually they, in this game, they just name them stuff like ham, eggs, and other relate food-related stuff. Though I did get a couple interesting names before, so never know. Dead butterfly. You know, it'd be funny if I could summon Krampus and get a, and then get a, a what do you call it, and then get a Krampus sack or something, <laughs> and then I can't bring it over. 
That gathering is necessary. Very true, no life queen. You need a lot of twigs, a lot of flint. Flint actually gets a little less useful than, say, uh, gold. But you still need flint for at least your first weapon. After you uh, prototype all your golden tools and such. Besides, you could still make flint useful. But yeah, on this side of the world, daytime is long, and dusk is a little bit long, and then you only have one segment of night. It's pretty damn good. And we also got to start off with, uh, with Chester, which is pretty nice. Oh, I'm actually full up on my basic materials now. Cool. Alright, now we can explore around and see what we can get. Yeah, the items I brought with me were Miner Hat, Gold, and Rain Hat, and the Walking Cane. Those are the ones that are seem vital for my future journeys here. There's going to be a point where there's going to be endless rain, and that's why I want to be ready to have the have my Rain Hat. And he got lucky. <laughs> Well, this is, that's how this world's supposed to start off, and this is where a lot of people start building up pre-built stuff and and all that because it's the easiest to do so. The easiest time to do so. I do love how they do the pig village, though. Like, look at all this. Look, you got the walking path, like, all around them. It's nice. And we get to start with the touchstone here, right here. That, so we get, already, we get to start off with a free life here. Mm, we do have torch pigs. That's the only danger here. Yeah, I'll fight you when I get some logs. Or maybe I'll have all the pigs join in and fight them. That actually might work. And make Oh, I don't have any stone. But yeah, the pig village looks amazing. I love this. I wish I could... This is what I wanted to make in Don't Starve Together, is make a little village just like this. Hmm. I think this is one of the only times in adventure mode you actually even have a pig king. Eh, life-giving amulet. Cool. I may as well dig up graves. Oh, I should make a weapon first. Let's see. Just in case a ghost spawns. And I also... I don't have any logs, so I can't make any armor yet. But yeah. No, oh, no, I didn't mean to dig that up, but whatever. Alright. I do need to get some meat for these pigs. So I could uh, help have them help me fight. Where are the... I think spiders are on the other side of the world, and that's where it gets dangerous. Alright, let me move this stuff over. I'm gonna put you over here, and you over here. Chester back here. This is one way to get a bunch of gold, too. I'm not really worried about my sanity right now. In fact, getting shadow fuel would be good. Yeah, this is the time where I should be getting up a bunch of shadow fuel. So I can uh, raise up, you know, start making uh, nightmare stuff. Alright. We're ready now. Uh... There they are. I was waiting for them. I'm ready for you. Come on. Ah. Either way. I don't really need to keep uh, digging them up right now, though. 
I need to get four bunnies and I need logs. Alright, Jay Chester, it's time for you to carry your weight. We'll get all the stuff that's gonna be turned into gold. And things I'm not using right now. I'm gonna use this as my armor in case I die. It also helps your sanity. And heals you a little. In exchange for hunger. Since I don't have any wooden armor. This is where life gave me a minute, so it's sorta of neat. You could die and it won't matter as much. Other than organization being annoying. Oh, jeez, really? Come on. There we go. Let's heal up with Butterfly. Okay, I haven't been here yet. Yeah, this is the time to explore. Yeah, I think spiders are on the other side of the world. Or, uh, in the second world, I should say, because this, this is called Two Worlds. Because this is the peaceful place. You could live here forever, and you won't bother anybody. Hooray! But if you start trying to f locate the things, that's when it gets dangerous. Oh, no. That's what Maxwell warned us, basically, in the beginning here. Which, if one could not tell, he is the big bad. Oh, torch pigs. Oh, wow, that's a huge... That is a huge shrine. Hmm. I don't have any meat for them. Not unless I kill a regular pig, which is difficult compared to a were pig. See, that's the other side of the world here. We can't reach it from here. We have to get a go to it through wormholes. Hmm. Do we have beefalo over here, maybe? Oh, that's the wormhole in. Jump into sick wormhole. I think once you go in there, you can't go back. That's the whole point of uh, the sick wormhole. Which is why once you make this choice to go over there, you can never come back. Unless you have a teleporter. Which I don't think we do. I'm just trying to make sure I got everything. Yeah, I haven't explored everywhere yet. I could have sworn, though, that in some sometimes in the adventure modes, it would actually just uh, have a second actual portal, but it's harder to get to or something. All right, and that's where we were. Yeah, even on the map, you could tell that the sick wormhole is uh, faded a little bit compared to the dark pink that it usually is. Man, I forgot about sick wormholes, because they only show up in adventure mode. Yeah, if we had some beefalo, I think I'd be able to get meat a little easier. Oh, I can kill some, uh... I can kill some of the bunnies. That's one way to do it. And we got plenty of grass and twigs, so why not? That's how I'll get my starter meat. No, not a backpack. There we go. Ah. There's not many bunnies, otherwise I'd just dig them up and such. So, since we got basically an unlimited amount of grass and twigs, I'm just going to do something that you normally really shouldn't do and just make a bunch of traps. You really should only make like one or two, and then that's it. Because bunnies are not really something sustainable to live off of. 
usually. Stop bogarting your king. Damn torch pigs. Gotta regather some grass after making all those. Defend! All the bunnies. Yes, all of them. I'm gonna continue exploring. I just wanna grab what I can see here. Anything that's. That anything I'm low on, such as grass and twigs here. But yeah, even if they're nightmare bunnies and such, I can still use them for... I can still use the monster meat that they'll end up dropping. Yeah, the sucky thing about eventually leaving here is that not being able to come back and all. Oh, and the mole worms. I forgot about them. Source of meat. Thank you. Let's see if I could start a pig war. They take a little bit longer, but it's still, it'll help. I want those pigs to help me with just fighting off the ones near Pig King. And possibly all the hair. Oh yeah, you're right. The beard hair wouldn't be bad either. Alright, I'm going to take the pig from furthest away. So the ones that are close by can help. Ready? We're going to attack you. No, no, come on. You can do it. Believe in yourself. Once they hit him, all the other pigs are coming in. Right? No? Aww. Because it's pig on pig violence, the other pigs don't want to get involved. That's like social commentary right there. I'm sorry, pig. Uh, his name is Bob Venus. Well, in other words, I just kind of upgraded my uh, morsel to uh, giant, to giant, uh, giant, I'm sorry, uh, to big uh, pig meat, or big meat. Yes, yes, you're saving, we know, and that's adorable. Oh, I pooped. <laughs> hey, everybody, look at me pooping. <laughs> Hmm. I could make a berry bush hat. Yeah, but why not? I haven't gotten my logs yet either, so let me just focus on that next. That's one of the big things to get to get my log suit going. No. Let's try again. seen any places where I could fish either, come to think of it. But then again, I don't have any silk, so I guess that point is moot. Thank you, butterfly. Butterfly are the easiest way to get your health back. At least until I can find some blue mushrooms, but then uh, I won't be, I'll be losing sanity, so eh. Since daytime over here is huge, we should be good. Thank you. No, no, try again. There we go. Oh, I didn't need that extra twig. 
And bye bye. Yep, we're almost full health already. Oh, I don't need twigs, I need grass. And then I need logs. Alright, you hold on to these here. Oh, why do I have the grass tuff? I don't need that. I said, I don't need that. Thank you. You might be wondering why I'm going only for the larger trees, and that's because they yield more logs and also come with uh, pine cones. So I could replant more trees than what I chopped down. The medium sized trees uh, are ones that uh, only drop one pine cone, so it's like for every one you chop down, you'll replace it. These are the medium sized ones, anyway. Therefore, it's usually better to chop down the largest trees first. I mean, if you're desperate for wood or you don't care, go ahead, go nuts. And oh! Spiders, finally! Greetings, spider. I'm going to kill you. And then I'm going to gather grass for some reason. Thank you, and have a good day. <laughs> I didn't realize they had some spiders here, so that's good. Mine. Get over here. Where did I, where's my walking game? There we go. I said die. There we go. I didn't gather the other one. Death to all the spoods. Yes. All you butterfly, get in my belly. This is, actually, I only need one. There we go. Yeah, I only need that one just to get my health back here. All right. So I can't do a pig war, which means I'm going to have to gather a lot of meat, and monster meat specifically, to uh, accomplish my goal here and taking out some of those torch pigs. Why I want to do that? Get lots of gold. Also, it's like a mini mission, really. Oh! Plenty of logs here. Man, I can't wait till I'm Woody and playing through this. I want to say that's who I'll be next, but uh, it's not guaranteed. Okay, and by the way, these trees, evergreens, they don't drop any pine cones, so you can't replant them. That's why it's best to only go for the large ones at all. Get the biggest bang for your buck that way. Now that I'm insane. Alright, I got plenty of logs, though. Come on, armor. There we go. Hang on. I had to turn put that on. And move my poop over. Okay. I always keep my light in my backpack, so... Where are you? Okay, you're over there. Yeah, when you're insane, it's... The light's a lot more saturated and you can't really see. I think that's the right word, anyway. Alright, 
let's see. I like Pigtown here. Though, Pigtown would be deadly if you were Weber. Which eventually I'm going to have to do, so, hmm. I'll have to bring some spiders with me. Or, like, spider nests. Something to keep in mind when we do Weber run, I guess. You know, there's no birch nut trees. I wonder if maybe birch nut trees weren't in the first uh, version of the game. Alright, let's explore the blackness here before we move on, because I don't think there's any things in these. But we may as well uncover everything that we can in case there's like another nest of spiders somewhere. We also need to get some rocks. So I want to go this way next. I kind of wasted a couple days here, I know. <laughs> But you want to get as many days as you can here. Oh, Mandrake. I really can't do anything with them at the moment. But if I could get my magic hack, I mean, uh, Festahashiator going, I might be able to. Though I also do need to get a... I also really need to get some tree guardians to spawn too, to, in order to make a pan flute. Pan flute's pretty OP. Alright, since we're passing by the spider... Wait, is there another spider nest down there? No, I, I miss... I thought something. I saw something, but no, I was wrong. But yeah, since we're here, let's kill some spiders again. We need your silk. We don't really care about you. I mean, we could also use your meat, too. Ah, oh, there you go. Alright, I think that's enough silk to, so we can start catching some uh, fireflies if we need to as well. Mostly to refuel our miner hat. Hey, piggies. I was about to try to observe them, but then I remembered I'm Wilbur, and Wilbur doesn't really observe, does he? Oh, I should check on my traps. We got a few. Oh, you want in, huh? Monster meat. Oh, we got beard hair. Cool. That's actually pretty decent. Oh, shadow. I mean, uh, nightmare fuel. That's good. Monster meat. And nightmare fuel. Cool. And we did get one more. I need two monster meat. All right, let's go explore the uh, darkness over here. Hey, I got the wrong thing for exploring now, don't I? More piggies. More poop. I think that was must have been mine when I was walking by, huh? I don't see anyone else pooping and stuff here. Unless I dropped a, a flower petal, but eh. Because when pigs eat flower petals or anything that they consider vegetables, they poop. It goes right through them.
I wish Shipwrecked had an adventure mode, but it'd probably be very buggy like the current game is. Well, we got plenty of piggies, and some of these are isolated piggies, so I might be able to try and take them out. I'd rather not, but because it's not really worth it compared to where pigs been. Ooh, a pond, so we can get make some fish. And some frogs, too. We can kill some frogs and get some more pigs to recruit for our army. Eh, yeah, oh well. But yeah, flowers, I mean flowers, uh, butterfly are, are going to be our, what do you call it, uh, healing item, food, um, well, healing resources. May as well chop some more shit down and get some more logs. And make a campfire in advance. You might notice I never do make any farms because farms just are not worth the time and effort to put into them. The only exception might be is if you want to make a specific, uh, oh good, some some green mushrooms. But the only time it, they're really worthwhile to make is uh, when you're, when you want a specific farm item to make into one of your gear. Like say if you really wanted to do uh, the watermelon, fashion melon. Well, the only way you're going to get a melon is if you uh, make a farm, so that's when it's okay. Or if you want to make powder cake, which is one of the, reasons, one of the only times I really use uh, farms. So you could attract gobblers when you uh, knock out... When you knock out the... Uh, when you start picking uh, berries and gobblers come out, so yeah. That's another thing you can do. Alright, we got plenty of logs plant these. The other time that farms are okay is if you're wicker bottom, because wicker bottom can make farms grow fast, but still it's not worth it in especially not worth it in adventure mode. Not unless you're gonna you're stuck or something and you were desperate for food, I guess. And even then you're probably better off not. Alright, I could make a chest in advance. Oh, I don't need to get those. Alright, I'm crazy at the moment, and I can't see shit, so I gotta put my light on, even though it's not nighttime. Now it is. Okay, there it is. I knew there was a wormhole. An actual wormhole. I'm gonna put on my log suit, because I can't see when they're coming here. Oh, I pooped. Oh, no, it's just the poop that's in there. But okay, I can... I'm not gonna make a... I'm going to just get rid of the beard here. I don't really need that right now. I am going to make this net. Got to hurry. Can you get it? Yes. Okay, we're good. <laughs> he looks adorable with that on. All right. I don't think I'll be needing more wood, really, but... Let's just get enough for a chest. Oh, and since I have a fire going, eat the, cook up these uh, green mushrooms. There, get my sanity back. And may as well conserve some things by cooking some berries. Gives you a little... What the? Oh, I accidentally ate monster meat. God damn it. They're right next to each other. But yeah, you, since cooked berries give you a little bit more hunger, it can, helps you out. But alright, I'm going to get rid of the axe. I don't need it anymore. For the time being, at least. Oh, speaking of which, actually, hang on. There we go. Make a campfire in advance. Keep the silk. We got our wormhole way back, so we can go to the other place and be able to come back. That is very important. <laughs> All right, as adorable as this rain hat makes you look, I don't want to waste it, so here you go. That's why exploring is important. All right, and this is where we started. All right, we explored everywhere, so let's get those logs going. I mean logs. 
get the rocks because we want to get a hammer and hammer down some pig heads and hopefully make a uh, make a hammer I mean hopefully make a hand bat uh, you stupid whatever I don't feel like dealing with you right now oh wait that's monster meat I mean that's meat right there that, that'll be good for our war hang on come here I got a juicy berry right here for you wait for it be lining there you go. You're dead now. I don't need niter. Oh, I pooped again. Yeah, I could avoid the niter. To be honest, I probably could avoid some of the flint, too, if I wanted to. But I'm not going to, but yeah, I could. Thank you, butterflies. I would really hope I never am in a situation where, in order to, for me to survive, I have to eat butterfly wings. <laughs> Oh, there's some ice there. If I had my crockpot all set up, that'd be pretty good, too. Oh, a gobbler's still around, are you? Look, a juicy berry! Look, a dead gobbler! Let's see if I can summon any more, because more meat is a good idea. I want more rocks, not just for a uh, hammer, but I also want some for uh, for anything I might want to prototype or to replace, such as maybe when I put down my alchemy engine I pre-made, I'll uh, be able to make another one in the future. So, hmm. I just realized I could also just go to sleep in the tent and get my all my sanity back, but that's annoying. And also, everything goes down, and I don't really like using the sleep functions in the game. I mean, I will if I'm, when I absolutely positively need to, but it's still like, I don't, it's just not my thing. It wastes time. Okay, I'm full on rocks. We'll explore in what's over here, and then we'll head over to the Pig King and have a pig war. For the lulls, of course. Oh, this is a lot of trees. I might be able to maybe spawn a tree guardian. Oh, but I dropped my axe, so I'm not going to bother unless I run into it again. All right, piggies, it's time to go to war. Gobblers have sacrificed themselves for this. All right, here's our army. We march. Let us go. And it's too dark now. I have the light. Get over here. They won't retreat home. As long as I have the light, they're fine. Good stuff. Sorry if I go quiet. I've been dealing with the stomach bug for the last 12 hours. I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay, though. 
You do you. Where is the sun? The sun is me, and the time is now. Let us ride into battle. Nicely done. To the next one. Piggies, go. Thank you. I can make a uh, hand bat now. Kill the next one. Pig Wars! I'll take that. We only have one more torch pig left. Get him! Hey, Kawaii. You did it, guys! Our pig war is done. Except, not really. We're gonna attack Leo. Sorry, Leo. You didn't do enough. We're just getting rid of them, really, right now. Oh, now they're fighting each other. Cool! I am fine with this. Yeah, now go get custard. In Pig Wars, no one's a winner. Alright, I can take off this. You love friend, don't you? Until friend. Oh, wait. Friend can't attack you right now because everyone is awake and would attack me if I do. So I'm just going to let hit this one live. He is, Matt is the champion, everybody. Let us honor his victory <laughs> with gold. Oh, wow. I ran out of room for gold. All right. Chester. Thank you. Actually, now that you have room, you could probably hold the rain hat. I gotta keep the rocks. Nightmare fuel I'll hold on to. I still need silk for a top hat. Oh, well, let's make my hammer now. Because we're gonna do some piggy hammering, too. Actually, oh, that's another thing I could do. Here, attack this pig and you're going to die, uh, Matt. Sorry, Matt. You did your job, though. Whoa, really? Did I just start inside a inner pig war here? Numerian, jeez. He got pissed off. He just was not taking it anymore, but unfortunately his revolt has failed. Now we can make a football helmet. And a hand bat. Actually, I'm just gonna... Take this. You don't need this. Really? I want to keep the net. I shouldn't need the shovel. Or the pickaxe. Yeah, we're going to do this. Oh, damn. Rip pig. Yep. <laughs> but we're going to take their supply... Take all this... All their supplies. And we're going to turn this into a new pig house. For me to have pre-done. Just in case I need a buddy sometime. Let's see. Handbat can be made. Uh, football helmet, too. Ooh, I'm actually low a little bit. A little bit low on grass. That nice base. Hey, Marcus. You gonna lead a revolt? Or will it be peaceful? Who knows? 
I always hammer the head spikes too. Oh yeah, they're, they're very good. Hmm, beard hair. All right. Uh, here. He Monster meat. Hmm. You know what? I'm actually gonna drop two of the gold. Looks like yeah, they're all clear. Let's grab uh, some grass, and then we're gonna head to the new world. These are now homeless piggies. I would start a war with the piggies that are worshipping the Maxwell statue, but uh, eh, we don't need to do that. Oh, wait. Before I do. The other reason to get a hammer is because I don't want those torch pigs returning. Oh, free poop. I actually don't need any more logs, thank you. Alright, I think the hammer... Oh wait, the hammer might be used in the, in the deadly world still. Looking over things. And you always hammer the head spikes too? Yeah. Oh wait, I think you, you already said that and I already <laughs> addressed it. Trying to remember is a little bit hard sometimes, sorry. So right now, we're going to fill up on our grass one more time, and then we're going to head over to the new world, because we got everything we need. I'm going to set up a mini base over at, uh, in the new world, and, oh, hello. Hello, Tyrannosaurus Allen. Nightmare fuel, that's cool. But yeah, I, I imagine there's going to be plenty of, uh, spiders over there anyway. So I may as well grab a bunch of berry bushes and such, too. Maybe gobbler meat, if they decide to show up. I mean, I actually can get back now, thanks to the portal we found uh, near the beginning of here. Actually, I think I'll take that instead of the sick portal. Seven... I may as well eat that carrot. Alright, we got it. Things we're not going to need. Um, these are the home. That's a homeless pig there. Sorry, can't help you. I'm not going to take the sick portal in. I might want to take one trap with me just in case. And we're going to take the regular portal in, because we know we can get back. Eventually, I may have to take the sick portal. I don't know. I doubt it, though, because there's always got to be a way back in case you miss some things, so. Get our supply of food. So we, uh, we spent six days here just kind of pissing around and getting our supplies. I can't kill that gobbler. It's dusk. It's too hard to get him. Not unless I had a long-range weapon. Oh, wait a second. Come here. I need the net, and you could hold on to the gold, I guess? Not the gold. I might need that. Uh, the extra logs. Because I might want to catch a firefly. Alright. I shouldn't need the beard hair, though. I'm not... I don't see myself making a meat effigy. It's very difficult to... To, uh... Purposely, fully gather enough, um... Beard hair. So I may as well... Raise my sanity here. Okay. Where's my net? 
I'm gonna drop the rocks for the moment. We need our light supply. Okay, of things to drop, monster meat really is not that necessary. I could sleep, but nah. Alright. Oh, that's where I dropped my axe. That's a shame. I'm not gonna get... Eh, whatever. I can get it if I... I can always come back. It's not a big deal. So, let's see. Got everything. Alright, Chester. Let's go. And we're starting off in the swamp. Looks like we don't have any uh, tentacles directly around us. Alright. Hmm, merm houses. That's not good. Wait, are there... There's tentacles inside there? Wow. Okay, uh... Mm, I don't think this is going to be a wise decision, but I'm going to go for it. First things first. Net, we could drop for now. This, we could drop for now. Make a hand bat. Drop the spear for now. Armor up. Oh. Oh, really? On the second hit? Alright, you're in for it now. Got one of you. Well, one of the tentacles helped me out. Okay. That actually kind of scared me for a moment because I was not expecting them to come out like that. Oh, really? Maybe it's time I showed uh, some tentacles who's boss. Oh, there's two of them. Like, right next to each other? Really? What a dick. Wilbur's a little slower, though, so I gotta be careful. Really? That's not a good time to shit. Okay. These fish are mine, bitches. I might want to use those fish to heal up, but I don't know. Oh, fuck. Uh, get over here, Chester. You can do it. Hmm. This looks like a decent spot to set up our mini camp, actually. I'm going to get rid of all those merms over time. And, uh... I could probably use the tentacles to help me come to think of it. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to we're going to set up here. I already could see they're fighting right now. So, let's get our alchemy engine set up. But we're also going to make a backup alchemy engine to, for the next area. Uh, what am I making here? Uh Sure, we'll put the crockpot here too. We could burn down some trees somewhere. Oh yeah, there's some in the swamp I could burn down. Let's make up some fish sticks. And there's some gears over there so I can make another fridge too. So that's not a big deal. Yeah, they're going to war big time over there. I'm actually going to keep the berries because they last longer anyway. Uh, we're going to do... Two electrical doodads so I could make another alchemy engine somewhere. Good. Then we want... I need a gear to make the net other fridge, and I need charcoal. Alright, good. Looks like they took care of all of them. Thank you. 
Thank you. Back away for a little bit. I know there's one there. All right, there you are. Yeah, tentacles took care of our problems here. Well, besides our sanity. Oh, Chester. get our sanity back anyway. Well, we got our food supply here. We got plenty of resources to help us out here, too. So we should be all good. I'm going to leave those alone because we're actually okay. Uh, Chester, just to keep you safe, I'm going to leave you right here. Ah, oh, you found, you caught me. Okay. Oh, a hound mound's over there. Yeah, I'm going to go insane a lot because I'm gathering stuff. Yeah, I can't beat all the tentacles on my own. There's no way. Come on, attack. Get over here, bitch. Come on. Thank you. I got plenty of resources for my helmet, so I'm not too worried. Walking King, go! Nope. Yeah, I'm surprised no mosquitoes are popping up, but I guess this is not a those aren't swamp ponds, so. Yeah, I'm gonna be going insane a lot here. Nope. Alright, bring it. I got plenty of healing, so I'm okay. You know, I probably don't need all this food, though. You know what? I'm gonna go with that and just worry about hammering down this shit. The others I'm gonna leave, because they're, they're good for emergency food when they respawn. No thanks. Okay. We're good there. By the way, you really don't have to set up a mini base here or anything, but I figured... It might be a good idea. Just to have a place to retreat to. What are you saying I could make here? Uh, I could make farms. I guess that will raise my sanity. Uh, but it takes too much grass. Fuck that. Thermal measurer? Yeah, I got extra logs and wood. That's fine. I'm not making a flingo. Uh, stone wall? Sure. That might come in handy much later. This is just to get my sanity back up, anyway. Yep, we can make that pig house like I wanted. Can't make bunny hutches in this. Wooden flooring? Yeah, sure. Any other structures? Checkered flooring, carpeted flooring, potted flooring. Uh, flooring is not that useful. Making cobblestone in here is not useful either, really. I mean, there's ways to make it useful, but you don't need it. Uh, healing salves I may end up doing. Actually, yeah, if we find a bu enough spiders, that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to focus on making a lot of those. Alright, I don't need to be carrying all this with me here, so we're just going to dump it down. Let's see. Sorry, I'm going to pause just to take a moment at my inventory and also to fix my stupid tablet that ho holds the chat for me. Because it keeps pushing, uh, pushing back on my... Uh, keyboard. It's the only place I could put it. I've tried 
different arrangements and it just falls because it's not I don't have a case for it anyway that's a I digress let's go get a uh, Chester too all that wasted food bothers me but it's I gotta remember it's not that big a deal all right healed up all right gold we'll keep the bulk there I did make a chest so I may as well put stuff in here stuff that I'm not gonna be using Chester should be carrying only stuff that I may be using in the future here I move this. I'm keeping the silk and gold and that plus a hammer. All right. We can do this, this. Oh, I can make a berry bush hat. That was something else I wanted to make. And a sewing kit eventually I do want to make too. Bush hat. Hmm. I don't like that I'm going to be wasting a lot of uh, grass, but I can get some more here. Yes, yes, you, we know you're full up. Here. There we go. Um, just in case, I will keep a life, one life-giving amulet here and one on Chester. So if I find myself in a hopeless situation, I could just equip it really quickly and hope for the best. Rocks. You know what, actually, I do want to put anything rock-related in here because uh, in case of a mole worm popping up. The bush hat, I don't think it will work very well, but you never know. Uh, I'll just do that. Alright, yeah. You keep this one. We're not going to need the nightmare fuel just yet. The extra gold, no. And the logs. There's no need for real organization here, though. And... Take a few... Um... I wonder if I could make any shipwreck re recipes with this right now. I doubt it, but it'd be interesting since I do have a shipwreck character in here. That would be helpful if I could. Alright, let's get a gear. Or, oh, fuck. They're like, you just came to the wrong neighborhood. Hmm... That looks like suicide. Yes, they do exist in here. Awesome. All right. I okay. Ooh, spiders. Good. We need spiders. I wonder if I could lure them to tentacles. Maybe I could do that. I have my armor on. Oh, hey, there you go. Go tentacles. I'm just going to keep running around in circles because I don't know where any spi tentacles are here. Wait for it. Wait for it. Run. Thank you. Bye-bye. I don't need to deal with this whole army now. Assuming they're not holding a thing behind them. Actually, I have my I'm fully armored and I got some healing. Let's just run. I'm going to get hit at least once or twice. Oh, fuck. Don't do this if you're not Wilbur and or don't have a walking cane, because holy fuck. Oh, my goodness. Keep going. Keep moving. Keep moving. Okay. Okay, keep going. If I was WX, this would be paradise, though. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Get out. Get out. <laughs> LOL. I think you just walked into a fat cat carrying ice cream and pizza. Yes. Oh, boy. Someone decided to follow me home. And he didn't attack Chester? I'm okay with that. <laughs> oh, and I left my hand bed in there. Well... That worked out pretty well, I think. <laughs> Wilbur is good for that. I might have probably would have been better off keeping the life giving amulet on me. No, no, then I'd drop everything, so that wouldn't be good. Anyway, let us get the this to make our backup fridge. In time, we're going to need to get uh, 
charcoal too. Oh, I missed a nightmare fuel. I mean, I wasn't very worried, but I probably should have dropped some things back at camp in case I was worried about losing them. But yeah, all right, so I made that. I don't really need to make anything else. I mean, not unless I feel really feel inclined to make, for some reason, a ice fling matic which I could do because there's some ice around here, but mm, <laughs> why? I could also make another divining rod. Interesting. Let me see what else. Oh, I have enough for a piggyback uh, for, for pig skin wise anyway. A siesta lean to. That's for heat. And I don't use that. We made an umbrella in advance. That's good. I uh, may as well set that up. And. Ogles, pumpkin lantern, lantern. Yeah, that's another thing. Pumpkin lantern, if you want, to, that's where a farm is useful to make, too. But you don't need a pumpkin lantern. Pumpkin lanterns are not. You don't. It doesn't give a lot of light, to be honest. And I don't think you really carry it around. You just place it around. So, yeah. I think we got everything we need there. Also, I'm going to put you in there. I'm going to grab some extra materials now. Because, yeah, this right here is just a farm, really, for killing a bunch of merms, if you want. Until they beat the ten finally beat all the tentacles, anyway. Which will happen, eventually. You know what? I got so many boards. There we go. Actually, I could have used the flooring. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Nightmare fuel away. I'll take the rocks. I already I'm already healed up. That's good. I may as well eat again and use up some of the berries. In the meantime, make a torch. Uh, torch, because we are going to be burning these trees down for charcoal. Because these trees do not matter in any way, shape, or form. I haven't once used my divining rod, by the way. I guess they consider frogs to be uh, evil because they left them here, but frogs are just chaotic. Oh, there's the wormhole we came from. Oop, I'm overheating. <laughs> huh, frogs don't trigger tentacles. Interesting. I wish they did, because that'd be very fun to watch. Make another meatball in advance here. But yeah, this is why football helmets are very useful. And also, Chester, you stay out of the way. I don't want you getting caught. It's very easy for Chester to get caught and then just killed. But yeah, these trees are worthless. At best, you get two logs after digging one up. And a twig. Normally. So, you may as well just kind of chop them down, I mean, uh, burn them and chop them down for charcoal. I consider them, like, in the winter, I consider them trees just for, uh, just for that purpose, to keep you warm with, uh, keep you all warm and, uh, light, light it out, so yeah. Okay, meatballed. I uh, where do we keep the stone stuff? 
Did I actually use up all the stone stuff? Wow. That's cool. I need three. Two and three. There we go. We got our backup uh, crock pot now, too. Eh, I could make a drying rack. Wait. Ooh, one more. Okay, I thought so. Get my sanity back up a little, too. And the rest we'll just leave right here. I don't think I'll need the gears anymore, so I'm just going to drop them. Let's see. Oh, you know... Sorry, i got to pause for a moment. One cool thing is, when I eventually use wood legs for this, uh, for adventure mode... Oh, that's going to be so much fun, because you can do a lot with wood legs, because he has his lucky hat, which gives you treasure. And even though you can't make a bunch of those in Reign of Giants, as long as you keep it... If as long as he, he gets a sewing kit in it ahead of time, he'll be good. He can make a uh, he'll be able to maintain it and keep getting random treasures. And the random treasures can make the runs very OP at times. So that's gonna be pretty fun to do later. But the only problem is he has constant sanity drain. So getting a getting a Tama Shanter is gonna be a must. Oop! I pooped. All right. I also won't need my axe for now. I want more silk, and I might, yeah, uh, I wanted to get a lot of silk to make a top hat, and then I wanted to go back, get the, get the bunnies, since I have full sanity now, get the bunnies, make a Presti Hashiator, and then start making uh, shadow stuff. It's for the future, really. Alright, spiders. Um... Really, Tentacle? Alright, fine. We'll take care of Tentacle first, because Tentacle's being a little bitch here. Eh. Wasn't far away enough. Sorry I'm not chatting, but I'm in the office today and watching while working. That's fine. Get over here, spider. That should have attracted some spiders, right? All these tentacles are doing all the work for me. Fuck it. I'll just start tearing down these and I'll get the silk this way. Alright, I need one more. Oh wait, no, I only need six, actually, so I'm good. Alright, we'll head back to our old world. Uh, let's see. Make the hat. Good. Then we just need four boards. Check. And four bunnies, which we will grab with the trap. Alright, let's head back to our old world then. Come on, Chester. We ride! Am I even going the right way? No, I'm not. I'm going way too far away. Alley -oop. Yeah, if we took the sick wormhole, we wouldn't be able to get back, so. I did take a hit to my sanity, but that's okay. I do like that there's that there really isn't a long night time in either world. Oh, I also could restock up on my grass now too, and grab you. I wish I didn't drop my shovel at the moment. Oh, perfect. Whatever, I'll make another one. It's not the end of the world. That's one little rabbit. Uh, you can hold my excess stuff for the moment. 
want to keep that. You're my, that's my fuel, but I don't want to, him to hold it because in case he dies. Uh, speaking of which, there we go. But yeah, it's okay. Just, just you guys watching is nice for me, though. You guys don't need to be chatting too much. Being at work and being sick are kind of like you know big things, so it happens. I remember when I first played this, I thought the sick wormhole was the only way you can go and you can never come back. And then I later found the wormhole that returns you here, and I'm like, ah, oh, son of a bitch. Which makes sense, because once you use the sick wormhole, you can't get back, but what if you use the, uh... What happens if you ended up using the touchstone? How the hell are you going to get back to the d dead world, you know? Unless they made it a one-way only, but kept the sick wormhole there? I don't know. Still, it makes sense why they had to do it that way, but... It is a kind of like a noob trap in a way. Oh, I just realized all these were rare pigs last night, but it was such a small night, I wouldn't be able to get much out of it anyway. Alright. Bunnies. Hmm. Ah, beard hair. I'm getting more of that than I realized. Ah, Chester, you messed things up. If, he, if the ch trap fails, I'm just going to dig them up anyway, so. Because it doesn't matter. That should have trapped them. There we go. That's two. Three. Now, if I wanted to really chase this in, I would, but... Oh, hey, cool. I didn't have to. And I even got an extra. Let's kill one. May as well. Alright, we got our four. We can make... Presti Hashiator. Thank you. And we caught another bunny. Alright, we got the Presti Hashiator. We actually have some gems to worry about, too. Oh, you know what? I'm going to dig up all the rest of those graves, get all the gems I can, so I can use them. My sanity will take the hit, I know. Maybe I'll end up using that tent after all. Homeless piggies. Eh, free gear. I didn't have to go through killing those, or having tentacles kill the clockworks after all. Oh, really? Alright, so this is how you kill a ghost. You do hit, run, hit. Oop, sometimes you're not fast enough. Oh. Hmm, I think it's different from don't starve together. <laughs> when it's already red, you can't, apparently you can't attack it. And don't start together, it's just hit and run. Hit and run. Oh, really? Another one? Alright, he's angry. Wait for it. Wait for it. Great. Ah, oh, he, he had lingering damage? That's stupid. Nope, 
I need this nightmare fuel, so go ahead. Keep going at me. Come on. Thank you. Aw, oh, I left my walking cane there. I don't really need the lying robot. Alright, red gem. I think we're good. Ah, there's another one. Eh, they not. I, I, I've got plenty of gold. Alright, weapon? No, you don't ever go in there. Oh, and a full moon, these all... Spawn, all the open graves spawn ghosts, so that's something dangerous to worry about. Hi, Piggy. You're homeless. Actually, since you are homeless... Come here, come here. You can be my friend. Marcus is my friend, guys. He will be with me until the end, which probably will be very soon. Knowing our, my luck with piggies and all that. I didn't need the extra twig. Actually, you know what? Let's just eat the flowers. Bring up the flowers and go. I'm not planning to return here anyway. Again, not planning. I might, but even if I do, it's not a big deal if I end up leaving some, uh... If I end up taking all the flowers. Yeah, the act of just picking up flowers helps your sanity. You could also make that stupid uh, flower hat, but it's just uh, not needed. Oh, wait. Piggy, come here. <gasps> oh, it's a full moon. Marcus, you're not my friend anymore. Sorry, Marcus, but you were turning on me. That's a shame I didn't get him to eat the petals, but oh well. Eh, why not? Again, not too concerned. I forgot about the full moon. <laughs> Which is funny, because I was just talking about it not long ago, either. Alright, three more. There we go. Uh. Alley -oop. Well, Marcus was my friend for not very long, like I called it. Alright, it's time to go thing hunting. Luckily with, uh... Luckily with Wilbur, this should actually be pretty fast. Because we're not going through different, all sorts of different, uh, issues like we were in the other worlds. Anyway, first things first, let's... Let's make some more of that. I'll leave this out. And... We'll make a Presti Hashiator. Which we should be able to make a, a shadow manipulator if we got enough shadow stuff. Yeah. Oh wait, I can't because I don't have... Uh, I don't have any of the living logs, unfortunately. That's unfortunate. Well, I might bring the axe after all. Just in case. This is my extra gold. Let's make an ice staff, though.
Life giving me a minute. Chilled. I don't need that. I can't make a fire staff until I have a shadow manipulator, which is unfortunate, but it's okay. Ice staff is where it's at. Oh, I think I got hounds. Yes, I'm glad that we have uh, Serpent Turf. That helps so much with our uh, sanity so fast and easily. I could make more life-giving amulets if I really cared to, but nah. And that'll be good for later. Alright, the gear can go away. The manure is our ranged weapon if we really need it. I'm gonna wait till these guys spawn on me and then we're gonna go exploring. Uh, I may as well keep the silk over here. Old poop. Minor hat. That looks... Oh wait, actually, keep the minor hat on me just in case. And... Shouldn't need anything here, but there we go. All right, Chester, let's get ready. Mm, that's actually going to go bad sooner than later, so just eat it. Oh, I don't need that. I think if I do this, it'll last longer. Sorry, I, sorry, I hit the mic. Again. You got so excited you pooped. <laughs> I also could have used the tentacles if I really wanted to. Alright. What observe where the green bar is there. When I grabbed this one, it went up. Yeah, it was freshened up, that's why it worked that way. Okay. I can't make any more though. Let's see. Eh, I could do one, two, and make a meaty stew as well. May as well keep the ham or the large meat cooked. Oh, fire went out. leave that in there. Only meat lasts longer when you cook it. Uh, veggies and fruit will deteriorate faster. So if you're like, you're carrying it, like if I was carrying berries and they were starting to rot, that's when you cook it and eat them because they'll be, they'll extend their life then. <laughs> anyway, um, all right, I'm literally just going to run. I'm going to find all the borders and run. If I can grab some things on the way, so be it. That's the good thing about Chester, plus walking cane here. Alright, we got hound mounds here. Oh, cool. I'm taking that and running. Free beefalo hat is nothing to sneeze at. I hope your Chester is okay. Running around at the speed of sound. <laughs> Chester should be okay. He heals fast, so... Alright, thing one. Got it. Chester coming. Chester, you coming? Chester, you coming? Please be coming. Good. Next! Go! Nope. I'm good. I do have only 5% left on my football helmet, though, so that's... Next time I have a moment to stop, I'm gonna have to take care of that.
Chester auto should auto teleport to me when I get too far away from him. Okay, good. Thing two. Done. Wait for it, wait for it, and run. I forgot to make the new football helmet, but whatever. But yeah, this part actually is easier because you're not really searching too hard around. You're just kind of uh, running around a large, one large biome instead. Thing three, done. We have one more to go. See how fast this is going? And thing four, done. Now we just need to find the thing to put them all together. Touchstone, awesome. I'm grabbing that. I'm good, thank you. Dead ends are what I have to worry about right now. <laughs> Chester may die. Uh, killer B zone, oh shit. I was gonna say, ooh, safe zone, but no. Nope. No sale. Chester, did you survive? You're good. Good going, Chester. May as well eat the serpent turf. That will heal everything. All right, one, two, three, four. Got all four. Like I said, just gotta find uh, find where we plant these all. On the plus side. This looks like a big enough forest. Hmm. But I got plenty of goddamn spiders to worry about. I'm literally only chopping to get a tree guardian. Concerned about the wood. If I was woody, this would be so much easier. Okie dokes. Golden axe go. This also killing the the single chop trees are also ways to trigger it. So uh, I got just got a message from I mean sorry a call from a robot. It looks like well it can wait. Tree Guardian! He arrives. Alright, and good thing about being near a swamp, we have tentacles to take care of it. Uh, assuming they trigger tentacles, I'm not actually sure. I think they do. And yes, they do! Just gotta get it closer. Now, there we go. Tentacles will take care of it. Or they'll take care of tentacles, either way. Hmm. Do spiders attack that? No, spiders don't attack, uh, attack it at all. Damn it. 
But we got plenty of tentacles of, to go about. Street Guardian, uh, you want to come over here? Oh, I got a message. I don't really have room to be fighting these without getting the whole clan after me. Hmm, I didn't bring the torch with me, did I? Do you have the torch? Yes, you do. Alright. I'm going to... Oh, man. Oh, good. They're all going after tentacles. I'm thinking of burning all the... Burning all of these, anyway. Okay, you can carry the things, Chester. Time to make a forest fire that make would make Willow proud. And then I could take out the spiders in the day. I didn't want to do this at first because I wanted to worry I wanted to make sure I get the tree guardian. Yeah, worry about the tentacles, spiders. Don't worry about me. I'm a nobody. No worries. Nope. Nothing to be see here. Hmm. That one's going to be more difficult to burn. I have to burn some of these directly. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Killer bees. Jeez. I didn't see them behind the door. Behind the tree, I mean. Well, this is why Serpent Turf is here. No, burn something. Just burn it. Burn! God. There we go. See, Serpent Turf is amazing. My fire went out. No. I'm burning this. Chester, shit. I have to keep moving. Chester died. Damn it. I should have left Chester behind. I'm taking that hat. That hat is mine. I can always get those back. I'm not really concerned with this. Do killer bees attack spider? Yes, they do. I remember now. But the spiders don't trigger them. I think some killer bees just fought some. Yes, they did. I mean, this, the killer bees are going to die, but it takes the pressure off me. Ooh, Vlag. There's a lot of spiders and killer bees going on here. Yeah, rest in peace, Chester. It's okay. He's a good boy. He always comes back. Oh shoot, this is tentacles. I literally just gotta keep moving. I'm fast enough, I could do it. As long as I'm not in the swamp, I just gotta stay out of the swamp, stay out of the swamp. I'm in the swamp. <laughs> I gotta move, 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 move. Okay. You're still attracted to me? Come on, stop that. It's an unhealthy attraction there. Football helmet. 
It's time to go spider hunting. I don't even need the monster meat. That's nice. Oh, really? All of you, huh? I can run, so fuck off. I mostly want to take care of that guy first. Ready, steady, go. Gotcha. Uh, you're too slow there, Wilbur. Yeah, Wilbur does have a slower than average speed, so... I did want to get these. Um... I don't need my shovel. Really? It lag attacked. I hate you. Ugh. Oh, I don't need the monster meat. I also don't need to be really fighting these guys. All I have to do is kind of trick them. Burn something near them, and go. Yeah, that thing sleeping right there is going to get itself killed. I could do this the easy way. Yep, come here, come here. And you're trapped. Yeah, 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 I know, you cheat. Come here. Yep, you got you saw me. Come on. Just go in there. Bye back. Now to figure out where I dropped my stuff. Or rather where Chester died. Ah, that's easy. It's right over there. Yep, you saw me. Come on, warrior. Go away. There you go. I don't need the monster meat. Here you go. Take it. Hmm, this really needs to burn. That's honey. Uh, here we go. This is where I was. Alright. Let's see. Attract, get attracted to me. Yep, come on. Thank you. All this just to get some goddamn uh, uh, evil logs or something here. Ah. The trap ran out. You know what? I'm just going to head back to our base and go from there. I don't really have to worry as long as I keep running. I don't have any room in my inventory, really, anyway. Hey, Sap, I'm just gonna take the silk and go. Yeah, yeah, I know you want me. I mean, who doesn't? <laughs> I pooped, but that's okay. But I do need to get some food anyway. Where am I? Oh, okay, there's a little nook over there. Go 
go tentacles kill them Hey you guys you want to get killed by tentacles that'd be cool to me Oh, yeah, this is where we were. And we got plenty of, uh, stale frog legs. Where's the fish? There should be some fresh, uh, merms popping up here. Because it's been a couple days. Anyway. I'll eat that. May as well make a fish stick to heal up a little bit. I'll put the crank thing here. Glands here. Oh, what am I doing? I just realized I got plenty of materials here. I can make my healing salves now. Chester is back! Welcome back, Chester. I'm going to have to leave you here, though, just to be safe. Let's see. Put the silk away. We're going to burn you. Eat some fish sticks. Yum, yum, yum. Uh, do I have my rocks on me? I do, and I have the healing glands in here. I already made a honey poultice once, too, so that's good. My goal is to get a bunch of healing glands and a bunch of... I mean, sorry, healing salves. Yeah, well, you know, I don't need it here. I can make that in my final stages, because that's where shit hits the fan anyway. Chester, you're going to hold that crank. Yeah, yeah the healing cells will be good. Uh, I got the silk. I could leave the rain hat. You know what? Chester, you hold the stuff that I'm going to be bringing to the final area. Because we're still on exploration here. Keep the axe, because I still got to kill that uh, tree guardian. Poop, uh, monster meat can go in here. I'll bring another... Let me see. Yeah, I'll bring another uh, fish stick with me, just to be certain. Also, while the fire's going, may as well cook these up. Yep, yay, Chester! Makes the frog legs last longer, at least, though. I'm surprised berms haven't spawned out of there yet. Do I have to hit it with a hammer to get them going or something? Because, yeah, normally they are supposed to respawn after a few days. On the plus side, i got plenty of rot to burn, so I'll take that. And give it a moment. I'll take that. Oh, you guys... Hey, you guys want to play, huh? Well, you know, there's some tentacles right here. Yeah, see, Wilbur's good at evading. Usually. I mean, when he stops, that's when he da and is most dangerous. Or, in the most danger. <laughs> see, you can use these uh, tentacles as a very good resource for food. I'll take this, this, and this. Oh, nope. Couldn't last longer. One, two, run through. It's not good to do that through the evil flowers, but that's okay. Ooh, butter. I'll take that. And I'll cook that.
And look at all this rot that we're going to turn into ash. I said, go. I'm going to keep the fangs, though. I do need fangs for making a sewing kit at some point. There we go. I can make plenty of healing salves now. Healing salves are going to be the way I get through this when I play as Warly. Because Warly can only make food heal him so many times. So he can actually go to sleep and he'll be fine. So that's actually where tents are going to be needed. Oh, there's a bunch of graves over there too. I could have got gems there. Anyway, we got we have a mission to go back over there. So let's get our running shoes going. Ah, oh, nice job, guys. Good work. Nah, I, I, I don't want to play. Uh, maybe next time. Yeah, if I was any other character, I would not advi necessarily advise this. You're not going to be as fast. You, you still can. Uh, you just will will not have the same amount of luck. Oh! You know what? I think it's time for poop. Mm. Damn it. Come on. I gotta get him. He's moving too much. Got ya! What the... Why are you attacking me? It was, I didn't even... Oh, did I hit them with poop? Really? You guys suck. Well, you know what? The tree guardian can follow me. And if he could survive, then so be it. Actually, wait. He might just get lose aggro on me when he, something else attacks him. So, uh. In fact, he probably just did. Nope, nope. Keep going. I gotta find my safe space here. <laughs> I think around here we'll do it. In the meantime, maybe I'll piss him off a little. I'm doing this just so I can make a shadow manipulator for the future. <laughs> just FYI. <laughs> okay, here he comes. The dick. Oh, Killer B really wants you, dude. You sure you don't want to... Killer B and me. We're going to two-man this. Yep, Killer B, go. You're helping me. <laughs> it's funny how you can get some weird allies, right? Go ahead, Killer B. You can do it. That Killer B's name is Maya. Maya the Bee. Come on, Maya. We got this. We did it. We rock. Thank you, Maya, for your help. Uh, Maya just started a war that I can't help her with. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's piss off some more tree guardians because I could use more. I should also have a trap ready. Oh, I just ran into you. You want to set the trap now? Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Just get over here. Yep, yep. There you go. I knew you could do it. Oh, that one spotted me. 
Yeah, that's bullshit right there. <laughs> uh, these charcoal trees, I mean, burnt trees are kind of annoying because you can't see ver them very well in the dark here. At least on my screen, anyway. Whatever. I got I got some fish sticks to take care of this, so. Uh, let me pick that up. I'm gonna switch to the log suit, cause uh, yeah. I need protection and light. Yeah, during the day, maybe I'll kill a bunch of spiders just so I can have room again. And then I'll make my way to get my stuff. Actually, as it is, I'm running out of room already. Ugh. Yeah, let's eat the fish sticks now, actually. Okay. Helmet on. The way I could tell where my stuff is, that little box there. Because when that dropped, it le always leaves a map mark. Right, those are the spiders. Don't care about you. I need room. I got plenty of silk. I'll drop that. I'm taking the gold, that's for sure. Hammer time is not now. Eh, life giving ammo I really don't need, but I'll take anyway. Yeah, let's just bring this back and then we'll make another trip if we need to. I know it's kind of annoying and I'm sorry, but uh, <laughs> I want to make sure I get all the stuff I need for the future chapters. Oh, really? Wow, that seems like a messy fight. I wish I could grab all that food, but eh, I don't need it. Uh, tentacle spots. Don't quite need that either. Hmm. Small safe space here. May as well grab some grass. And maybe eat some carrots. move too fast. <laughs> eh, free seed. See, this is also another time it is okay to use farms. If you happen to come across some farms, and you find some seeds, eh, plant them. Why not? Oh crap, this is a reed trap. There's nothing but tentacles in here. Plenty of reeds, but you, yeah. <laughs> and the only way to really reliably clear them is usually with bosses. You can try to do it yourself, but it's slow. I had one world with that once before. I'm gonna go around you. Am I even in the, I went the wrong way, god damn it. Get your speed running, go. Ignore everything, just run. You keep running. Not interested. I got distracted by the reed trap. <laughs>
Again, luckily I can run through that pretty fast. Yeah, I know, I'm insane. In the membrane. Oh, good. They respond. Wow, you are determined, aren't you? I need a better weapon. There we go. Shed some light on the situation. Okay, we got that. We basically could leave as soon as we find, uh... We find everything, anyway. Alright, I need that. I got the logs. And the purple gem. That's what I needed. Alright. Shadow manipulator. Done. I'm not gonna put this down here. I don't feel like gathering up another... Shadow... I don't feel like gathering more, uh logs really so what i am considering right now oh i can't make it with just this yeah dark swords only could be made with shadow manipulators that's a shame but all right i hit a goal i'm good with that i don't think there's anything really there that i absolutely need we should go exploring so you carry that chester you're with me Oh, and I just pooped. I do need to... I should need... I should say, bring food. Let's see. Um, I really can't make any healing stuff right now. Oh, wait. Yes, I can. Uh, hang on, Chester. I'll take this. Oh, new weapon. Because this hand bat's dying. I will take the fish. Oh, I, there's ponds right here. I could have been fishing this whole time, too. Yeah, I took a hit. That said, free fish is free fish. Look at all those tentacles. They'd one-shot you. Anyway, I got what I wanted. One, all right, one, two, three, and you. Oh, really? That's okay. You know, I need sanity so badly. I could just make all the other stuff that I was not doing. Since I'm not going to really be using a lot of this stuff anyway. So let's see. I could refine the gems. That's a good thing to prototype, actually. Nightlight. Um, do I have extra gold? I think I still do. Yes, I do. Okay, good. Actually, the nightlight can come in handy later. I don't need it, though. Uh, one man band, maybe. Life-giving amulet can be useful. Chilled amulet, not so much. Not in this game, uh, version, I mean, mode, whatever. I want to make sure I have light. I think, I guess the one man band's all that's left, because I can't really make the meat effigy. I don't have enough uh, beards. But that is something I guess I could have done, but I'm not going to go and do that. Oh, I can make a pan flute. I can make a pan flute. I can do it without the shadow manipulator. I just need five reeds, and uh, I'll pick up that... Um, I could pick up the... What is it called? The mandrake. Let's do that. Let's do that. We're doing it now. That I—that's the plan. 
<laughs> I can put these back though. Because pan flute is extremely useful in when you're like cornered. So we doing this. hard part is finding the mandrake because I didn't exactly pick it up or put it somewhere and you know it was crossing my mind too like hey maybe I should pick him up you never know and then I'm like nah oh actually I could, I could piss off some more tree guardians mm. tell you what while I'm looking for the mandrake I will just chop down these simple trees and if I get a Tree Guardian, cool. If I don't, oh well. The reason why I'm doing this is I could probably then put down a Shadow Manipulator and prototype stuff. And then also be able to still make another one in case I need more things. But yeah, this is why this chapter is really, really useful. It's because you, you have such an access, a huge access to different, uh, what do you call it? Different res enough resources to prototype everything you need for future chapters. Tree Guardian. So yeah, pro tips on how to get more Tree Guardians. Get the weak ones. Thank you. I should have... I think I have enough Shadow Fuel, too. Unless I wasted it. Either either way, it's not that hard for me to get it, come across it, so... Ooh, actually, I can easily do that. Go insane and, in, and sane again. So it's not a big a deal. Because we got those dark flowers right near us. Alright, I know I saw it somewhere around here. Oh, yeah, and extra twigs are cool too. Okay, thanks. Hi, piggies. It's been a while since I've seen you. Pigs eat them out of the ground. I think it's only monkeys that do. Sorry, I just had a passing thought and I'm like wondering, uh oh, what if they did? Oh, something to note I don't believe burnt trees when you chop them down can summon uh, tree guardians. Not positive, but I, that, I am pretty sure. I'm getting a little too obsessed with just chopping these down, aren't I? <laughs> it's addicting, because it's just like one chop, one chop. You would think they'd get a little more pissed off, though. That's why in Don't Starve Together, Maxwell is great for pissing off tree guards. Because they could also one-shot him, though. He's got to run like fuck. Alright, that's enough. Let's see. God, I love uh, how Wilbur's so fast. <laughs> Keep a sharp eye out. 
I know we ran into it once. I even pointed it out. Mm -hmm. Everyone keeping a sharp eye out? Make sure you do. Oh, torch pigs. Sorry, I got I got a little too curious there. Okay. All right. The green mushrooms are a good thing to be gathering since they'll help me with sanity control whether I want to be insane or not. Sorry, my tablet just turned off. So I couldn't see chat for a sec. Come on. Yeah, if you do see it, notify me whether or not it's by water, in case I miss it. Because you can't say, oh, west to the left, right, or something. <laughs> Considering how much I'm turning the camera. Oh, right. Because it's dark, I'm just going to focus on chopping trees to piss off guardians. Because we're not going to be able to see very well right now. <laughs> May as well gather up our stuff. Okay. One for the road. Bam. Hmm. Well, the nest over here grew a little. Alright, come on, mandrakes. Where are you? I want to bring that pan flute with me for future runs because there is some very dangerous stuff in the last chapter. Though Wilbur might be able to outrun it, I want to make sure I have like an emergency oh shit button, you know? Other characters are not going to be so lucky unless they're maybe WX and they get luckily struck by lightning. Actually, I think there's a way to purposefully do so, but again, not sure. Right, I think he was in the lighter green uh, turf here. There might have been more than one, but I only need one. And also, here's hoping I don't accidentally eat it or something. <laughs> I'm pretty good about that, but just in case, it's good to keep that concern out there so I don't. Actually, I think this is the, the area where I found it, too. Because it was uh, away from the pigs. Once again, I wish I picked it, but... I, again, I didn't think I was going to need it. Or able to use it. I'll snack on a carrot, though. Wait, was it the mandrake at the beginning here, maybe? That would be really awesome if it was. This is assuming nothing ate it, too. I don't think anything will eat it out of the ground, except monkeys. Drake, where the fuck are you? I'm back where I was here. I'll give it till the end of this day before I give up on it. I, I do want it, though, badly.
This is not necessary though to progress, it just makes things easier. Because I don't want to pro prolong this more than we have to, you know? We're basically already done with this world. You know what might actually help us find it, and it's going to sound funny. Let's go track a qualifant. It'll make us go different places. Some places that I might have easily overlooked. Uh-oh. This way... It's behind a tree, isn't it? There it is, behind the bush. Okay. Okay, this way. All right, it's ahead. Oh, it's a Varg, really? And that's why having that is good. Ice staves are amazing, guys. Remember that. Oh, lost his armor here. by the meat. Gotcha! Well, I got to show off that. That's cool. <laughs> I'm actually perfectly happy with that. I'm not perfectly happy with my goddamn uh, walking cane getting stuck over there. Ooh, I might have enough fangs now to make a sewing kit, so that's good. And let's make our new football helmet again. Alright, well, we didn't find Mandrake, but we at least did find uh, Varg and got to show that off, so... That's cool. I really would have wanted a mandrake. I'm going to try one more time on the other side, and then uh, it'll be nighttime by then, so I'll head back after. Also, I think Wilbur just pooped, but whatever. But yeah, that's why an ice staff is very useful, and you should always try to strive to make one when possible. I mean, don't make it your first priority. Make it like one of, like, okay, I am, right now I am stable. What do I need to do? I should make an ice staff so I can get myself uh, set up, you know? <laughs> to, it's a good defensive weapon as well as offensive. Like, if you have something that's fighting you and you just don't want to deal with it, you tank a few minor hits like I was doing with the hounds. And you just freeze up the uh, you freeze up the the main threat. That way you can take care of the minions just easily. I don't think I'm gonna be seeing the mandrake though. Just keep moving. Ah, carrot. You made me think it was. Ah, damn it! I hate you, uh, carrot. Right now. I was like, Mandrick? In the dark, it looks like it. Nice, thank you.
All right, we'll head back now. I can't keep prolonging this. I am gonna put, finally, okay, there it is. <laughs> I thought something like that was going to end up happening. Mandrake, get. Yeah. Alright, let's head back and finish this off. I didn't think it was over there, though, but whatever. We found it. It's over. We're good. I am going to gra keep grabbing some supplies, though. As long as it's on the way. Dead butterfly. May as well heal up, you know? Anyway, we got our mandrake. We're going to make a pan flute. Then... If we have enough shadow fuel, I may end up making um, a secondary shadow manipulator for later, but also prototype things from shadow manipulator so I have it in the future. But from there, we will end it. I can actually make some shadow fuel thanks to the nightmare flowers that we have. Oh, almost missed my exit. Oh, and I also want to make a uh, sewing kit. Where's my mini base? Right here. Sanity won't be an issue, because I got- I could fish at least, so. Alright, living logs here all together. All right, you're rotted. I'm guessing that was the meat. Oh no, the meat's fine. Let's see, and how is my shadow fuel? I got seven. I can make another one. Yeah, I can make another one. So, let's place this. Make another, and we're good. What can we make with this? Meat effigy, can't. Pan flute. We're going to once we get those cut reeds, which we'll do really shortly. One man band I don't care about. Nightmare armor and dark sword I do care about, so I gotta, I'm going to go crazy in a bit to make sure I do. But for now, let's go get those reeds. Uh, wait, Chester's not with us. Okay, good. I want to make sure of that. I play, left him here. I'll take this. I also will take a new weapon. Thank you. Tentacle spots were a bonus. Oh, I'm walking away from the reeds, really. But yeah, this is a very easy way to go insane. I haven't explored all here. All right. Walking King, go. Mm, not seeing reeds, just these losers. Actually, also, uh, Wilbur doesn't have a very high sanity threshold anyway, either. He's sort of like how Weber is, though maximum sanity. And there's our fifth one. I actually might want more. Oh! Maxwell's Tooth Traps. I don't know if I could run over those safely. I think sometimes you could outspeed them. But hey, we may as well explore, right? There's a set piece in the middle there. Very clever. But yeah, those are two traps that only get used against you. Ooh, 
Tall birds. I wish I knew about them earlier. Yeah, we may as well keep exploring because we might end up stumbling across our uh, destination anyway. Wait, what the hell? Oh, is that the other side? That is the other side. Cool. Yeah, the other side of the, the good side of the world is over there. Is this it? This is our destination here. Eventually, we will try to take care of them. You gonna... Do the two traps affect you? No, they don't. That's a shame. Would have been cool. Can I... Nah. That was worth a shot, too. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can run over it. Oh, I can't read because I'm a monkey. Alright, wait till I'm running. We're gonna try running over one. Okay, if you're fast, I'm fine. That's how it is. We exploring, we exploring. Oh, we've been here. Let's explore this way then. Is this the graveyard? It is. This is another way to go insane, actually. Faster. What are you attacking? Did some spiders get in there? Oh, they did. Cool. You know what? Let's just go insane. Oh, ghost. Not who I wanted to really deal with right now. Wait for it. Whatever. I didn't feel like waiting for it. Alright, insanity achieved. Alright, you're following me. That's fine. You can follow me back to base. <laughs> Look at all that. I wonder if I'm faster than the shadow creature. Be interesting. Not what I wanted to do. There, I can see him now. Armor, go. Just getting rid of him. Come on. Thank you. I do need more shadow fuel, but that's fine. But it'll be easy. Alright. Just to get some health back. Like some fish sticks. And sanity. This is a way to destroy my my sanity very fast. There it is. Come at me. Wait for it. Wait for it. There it is. Where did it where did its fuel go? Eat that. No, I'm I'm insane still, you dick. Get over here. Well, I'll just cure it. Actually. There we go. I could also make my own shadow fuel, so whatever. Still insane. Oh, 
I'm not even worried right now. Yep, come here, come closer. See, this is how you get shadow fuel very fast. Uh oh, I got two coming at me. I'm not really completely prepared for that. I mean, I know how to dodge both, but it's just annoying. And I can tank this, actually, okay. Okay, there we go. We're good. Where's my... Where did I put my backpack? Over there. I don't know why I carried the bush <laughs> again. We can make a dark sword. Yes, that's nice. But we, the first thing we want to do is pan flute me, bitch. Got that. Next, we can make our own nightmare fuel. Four dark petals equals uh, one nightmare fuel. Then we want to make a dark sword. Prototype that. Uh, bat bat, I don't think I can do. Nightmare amulet. I that's that's a possibility. Fire staff is more is more interesting to me. First things first. Gotta make a spear. Ooh, uh -oh, ooh. All right, telelocator staff could come in handy. Mostly to warp things away from you. It's a good defensive thing, but I don't need it as Wilbur. But in the future, that will be useful, especially for WX. And also, if I had—I mean, if I had the gems, I know I can steal some if I really wanted to, but I don't know if I really want to. And also, I still need one more nightmare fuel. You know what? Let's pick the rest of these. It's free nightmare fuel. Oh, really? You reach me? Way to be a dick about it. Uh, they're kind of fucking me over here. Come on, stop that. I also want to make a sewing kit. That's something else I need to do. After that, we're all set to go. I'm not really concerned about my logs right now. Oh, I am concerned about making fish sticks, though. I'll have to be concerned about that later. Really? That's rude. It's also rude to come over and attack me and then just kind of disappear like that. Seriously, guys, can you believe his manners? Alright. And these dark petals can go fuck themselves. That pamphlet's gonna be great. What else can I be doing here? I got plenty of gold. Nightmare armor. Uh, I don't think it's necessary. So really I'm just looking at maybe the nightmare amulet and the telelocator staff. Telelocator focus if I want sanity, really. And that's about it. And the seaworthy I can't make. It'd be a hilarious if I could make the seaworthy in adventure mode, but I imagine that would bug the shit out of the game. So, all right. Also, I don't need to carry the fire staff right now. Let's make a sewing kit. And while we're doing that, we will fix some of those hats that I'm going to be bringing. I know it's not 
I know it's not exactly damaged big time, but I like to make sure everything's nice and fine-tuned. Like that. What else can we do? I'm bringing the pan flute with me. I was going to try to steal some gears. Uh, put on the armor. No, no. Hang on. Keep the light on. And I don't need the shovel. Keep a weapon on you. Armor up. We're gonna go play with some uh, gears, uh, gears with clockworks in a moment. Let's see if any of them died over here. Yes, we got a couple. Wait for it. All right, one purple down. One. We got another one right here and run. I can make one so far. Oh, well, they're attacking something that else. Some of them are attacking something else. Ooh, wait. I can play Toro. Just keep going. Keep going. Run, run, run. Or you will be well done. Oh, I dodged that. I love this. Because th these guys can also... The rhinos can kill their own. Whoa. <laughs> I'm so amused. I don't know if they killed anything. Oh, I got a shadow. Follow me. Oh, I think... Yeah, I think the rhino followed me. Oh, please don't follow me too hard. Okay, good. It didn't. Uh, maybe it did. I need light first. No. Stop being rude. Let me get the light for you. Yeah, so many of them. That's the clockwork field. <laughs> hmm. Well, before I leave this place, I'm going to get my sanity up to full and all that. Uh, let's just cook you up here. Make a fish stick. Did I have a trap over here? Did I bring it? I brought it last time. Okay. Alright, frog, you gotta get the fuck away. Sorry. It's just policy here. Hmm. I'm not gonna fish over there. That just seems like I'm asking for it. make that telelocator staff, I guess. I don't really need it, but... Oh, no, the Nightmare Amulet's better than that, so... And I can make a telelocator... Wait, do I have enough gold to be sparing for that? I think my... I, I already got, just went to my reserves there. Yeah, I did. Hmm. I could stop by my old place and quickly get some, but I think gold's not going to be that big of a deal at this point. Because I always bring gold with me, too. Yeah, let's not let's not add more to that, though. We're not going to use more. Um, Alright. So, just to get myself 100%. Did I use up all my silk, really? Alright, well, let me go grab some silk real quick. Not a lot, just need, like, two. All right, fishing rod. We're gonna fish for about. Yeah, we got plenty over there. We're gonna fish for just. Uh... Oh, hey, fish right there. We need fish. The frogs are gonna be annoying though. Good timing, fish.
Get over here. Thank you. Not you. Jeez, someone doesn't know when he's not invited. Well, I guess I could fish at, after dark. It's not a big deal. We're fishing just so I can make more of those... Uh, Surf and turf, because that, that heals everything. This is probably the better time to be fishing anyway. I'm not worried about the Nightmare Amulet. I just wanted to prototype it so I can make it later if I need to. All right, two, it's about two fish each and you can get them pretty fast. Once you get go to three and more, it gets slow. Like that's instant fish. And this third one's gonna take a little longer, but I will be able to get it. But it takes even longer than that when you try to fish more. This is the last fish, I think. Yep, fishing rod's done. All right. We'll gather our things and head over. So, one, two, three, one meat. I'm honestly, right now I'm just kind of eating everything, because why not? And I could cook these. If you didn't have shipwreck, you wouldn't be able to make uh, Serpent Turf. Just FYI. Or if the world that you started in to do Adventure Mode didn't have a uh, shipwreck connected to it because it's a shipwreck exclusive uh, recipe and you do you do want to have it it is very good sanity and it increases everything it's just so good all right Chester you have everything I need right because I want to bring the rain hat beefalo hat hmm well you know what I'm gonna negate the beefalo hat so nope All right, I'll hold off on that. Where did I put my bag anyway? Oh, I put it over there. I can only bring four things with me, so yeah. I want to bring the gold with me, because the gold is very, very useful. So gold, pan flute, rain hat, and walking cane, I think are what I'm going to bring. Let's see. Also, one for the road, just in case I get hit or something here. My weapon. Ice staff I don't need to bring with me. I shouldn't need it over there. Uh, I, oh, I still have to battle in there. I still have to take on um, some of the clockworks to clear it. Hmm. Keep that on you. You know what? That's the first thing I'll be doing then. I'm going to head over here, take out the clockworks that are spawn are near there. I may as well armor up too. I don't have to worry about my uh, my materials right now either. Get an extra log suit. I'll grab a couple extra here. Let's go fight some clockworks. Not the giant band over here. We're going past them up and further up. I'm not taking on the whole the whole world's worth. It's gonna be nighttime soon. Alright, get a running start. And go. Yeah. 
Yeah, I can dodge a little bit, but oy. Did you kill anything on the way? Whoop. Keep running. All right. Yeah, that's like WX Heaven there, though. WX has it the easiest for this, and that's one of the reasons why, because there's so many gears. I think I could take a break here. Oh yeah, I got it. I'm bringing my miner hat too. That's for sure. Ah, oh, hounds. All right, fine. I'll take out the hounds and then we'll go. It's actually about to be winter, I think. And this is the longest I spent in the day. Oh wow, it's. I've actually been streaming a little bit too long anyway. I pissed around too much. Yeah, I'm going to head over here still. But I'll move myself a little bit safer over here. So when I'm ready. Come on, hound. Just show up. I don't care. Yes, yes, hound. Rough, rough. Come on. We know! We know you're coming! Just come already! Get over here! There we go. Go! Go! One, two... Oh, I thought I had to do three hits. Okay, cool. Next! I know there's more. Alright, one and two. Oh! The, they, the mines do affect them! Interesting. I think that's everything. Alright. Let's get a little closer. First one, horsey. I'm just tanking this. Alright, here comes Uncle Bishop here. Like, what'd you do to my horse? Well, too bad. I gotta tank you. Your turn, horsey. Get over here. Yeah. So we got some extra purple gems after all here. Maybe I'll make that staff anyway. Shame I can't do more with the gears. Alright, I should be good. You know what? Uh, drop this. And we're good. I didn't really have to, but I did that anyway. Oop, gold. I am taking all the gold I can still. Come on. Gold, and I'm gonna sneak to getting that. I'm gonna get take a hit. I know. Oh good, I didn't. I mean, I knew, I, did, I planned that all along. Yep. Running time. I'm gonna get, nope, I'm not. Spiders took the hit. Ha, ah, dodge. I really wanna have a war against these, uh, Clockwork some at some time, but uh, not nah, not this time, not in the stream here. <laughs> if I was making good time or something, I would, but nah. I also got to figure out what the hell I did with the uh, Chester's thing here. Oh, the eye bones all the way over there. Cool. All right, tell the locator staff you've been made. It is useful, just so you know. <laughs> All right, I got 18 gold. Let's make a run for it and go. Chester, please survive. Actually, you know what? Just to be safe for Chester, and just so I don't have to redo everything, we're going to run around this way. You're still going to get a couple of them, but it's okay. Oh, 
Oh boy. I believe in you, Chester. Believe in Chester. He will do it. He is the king. Alright, if I'm at this point, I think he made it. Oh, the traps, the traps, the traps. Back up. Okay. We gotta make sure Chester gets through these. Good. The traps hurt. I mean, you've seen uh, two traps in action, I'm sure, at some point. Okay. Let's grab the things here. We got one, two, three, and where is four? This and this. Alright, we're taking the gold. We're taking the panther. We're taking the walking cane. And last, we are taking... Well, I'm going to eat this. We are taking the rain hat, right? Oh, no, no, not the rain hat. The minor hat, which we want to fill first. Minor hat first. The rain hat, I'm going to... I'm sorry, rain hat, but you're not that important to me. It's not the worst thing in the world. Let's go. Fifty-two days total so far. That was twenty days, so yeah. Chapter four. I hear my dog barking. She's excited too, obviously. That was longer than necessary, to be honest, and that was my fault. But I needed to prepare for the future ones. The last, the chapter five is the toughest. This is chapter four, though, but I wanted to prepare ahead of time while I had the resources. Now, this should be a lot easier. Alright. And then this one we get after it loads. The game is a foot. No, the game is a hand. Oh, we start in the cold. Say, pal, you're really pushing your luck. Turn back now, or I may have to resort to drastic measures. Ooh, uh huh? Oh boy. And we don't start with the. Yeah, we don't start. Oh, there's a fire right there. Oh, thank goodness. I was gonna say, and we don't start with the thermal stone here. Looks like that. Oh, good. You get a winter hat and a couple basic stuff. The game is a merciful soul a little bit. It's okay though. We got our stuff. We're good. You only made it to chapter 3? Ah. Chapter 3 is really nice, though, you gotta admit. <laughs> if you had, uh, two worlds. But, we're gonna leave this here. We're gonna start, uh, chapter 4 here next time, because it's been three hours. I need a break. I need to walk around a bit. I need to eat. I might come on later. Thank you guys for watching. No Life Queen, uh, Kawaii, thanks for lurking and chatting every now and then. I appreciate it. Um... I may be on tonight. If I'm not, I will not be on tomorrow because I have work. Uh, I may be on the Thursday and Friday. Thursday I should be on. Uh, so uh, thank you guys for watching again, and I'll see you next time. Oop, got to move my chat here. Bye-bye. <laughs>